Some jobs go beyond the workshop. Some jobs make you come to them. We present the ATV All-Terrain Bus. For the jobs that demand function, strength, and mobility. Your truck just got one hell of an upgrade. Arrive on site and ready to work. Do what you need, where you need it, with the ATV. Highway, dirt road, or no road at all. You can drive as hard as you want. The all-terrain vice is designed to handle the toughest road conditions. All work and no play, no chance. The ATV is built to keep up with you when you're on the clock or off the grid. In a bind and need a pair of jaws or an anvil, mount the ATV in the mounting bracket and never miss a beat. Don't let a busted part or a blown engine kill a perfect weekend. Get fixed up on the fly and keep your crew on track. The Wilton All-Terrain Vice is locked, loaded, and ready to go. With features capable of handling jobs tough enough for the train, but accessible enough to use at home. The Bench Vice Series is cast with a professional-grade, powder-coated, rust-resistant finish for added durability and strength. The Vices feature replaceable jaw faces, permanent pipe jaws with a heavily reinforced swivel and lug base comes with a chrome-plated spindle and handle, 4-inch lug base, polished anvil and anvil horn. It features a spindle guard to help protect against dirt and chipping, and can be easily cleaned with a rag after use. You might think all vices are alike, but that's not true. Wilton vices are extra beefy. This is the 1765 Tradesman vice. Nice new rounded look, 6.5-inch jaw width, and I like this, it's mounted in the rear and swivels 360 degrees. Now that's versatile. We're heading to the factory in Illinois to see how they're made. When you're using a vise, you want a nice strong grip. That's what you get from the Tradesman by Wilton. Man, that clamps down really tight. On a lot of vices, there's some wiggle back here and I feel none of that with this. Didn't move one bit. Wilton's vices have been holding strong for 70 years. In 1941, in World War II, Wilton came out with the bullet vise, which was our entrance into bench vise market. It's a design they've stuck with ever since. All of our vices are enclosed in the back, and that keeps out chips, moisture, as well as debris. So it's gonna keep on working for a long, long time. Man, this thing's solid. Wilton makes their vices and other tools at their factory just outside Chicago, Illinois. For their heavy-duty tradesman vices, they ship in 50,000 pounds of preformed cast iron a week. There's a movable and a stationary for each vice. We machine both at the same time. The movable jaw and the stationary base are refined on a CNC. It's a computer numerical control machine, which allows us to do precision work on the castings. In the broaching area, they cut what's called a keyway. That's the opening for the sliding jaw. In the broaching operation, this keyway is cut, which allows the movable to be inserted and paired. Once they have the parts machined, they can start putting the vise together. They drill side holes, lock in the casing nuts, and put on the end piece. And they grind the edges so it's all nice and smooth. They also polish off the top of the jaws so they're perfectly parallel because the two parts got to come together just so. The spindle is the part that moves those jaws back and forth. It's cut on site too, part of a slick operation built to last. Our vices have a straight line pull system, which means the spindle and the nut horizontally act against each other and gives it that smooth spin as well as higher durability. Before final assembly, the parts get spray painted. For years, Wilton's been applying their durable paint in just one color. Hammer Tone Blue is trademarked by Wilton. Nobody else can use that paint. 
In final assembly, they put in lubricant and then the spindles. You never have to worry about greasing this joint again. Once we lubricate, it's a lifetime lubrication. With the rotating base on, devices are ready to be packed up for shipping. A Wilton vise is going to help you get the job done. Because with jaws like this, nothing's going to budge until you want it to. Thank you.